You requested more Gigguk, so here's more Gigguk. The final boss of harem anime. A hundred girlfriends. Let's check it out. I've heard a lot of good things about this show. Now, before you judge, this is exactly what it looks like. Some the harem genre stuff. is one of the most respected genres you can possibly find in anime. Said absolutely. I'm about no. to say. This is I'm about to say. I'm about to say. Respected by who? We find <laughs> Ain't anime. no way. Said, absolutely no one. This is a genre people often put at the bottom of the barrel of entertainment, along with stuff like the isekai genre, which, hold up. Okay. Nah, 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 nah. Okay. I ain't gonna lie, man. Isekai anime is not, it's, it's not for me, bro. I absolutely agree with. But recently, it feels like the genre Digimon, is going through a bit let's of an evolution. Go. No longer can you get away with some boring vanilla premise anymore. There needs to be some unique gimmick, like what if all the love interests were quintuplets? Or what if the winner was actually the loser? <laughs> or what if we have a show like Girlfriend Girlfriend, where a series said, instead of leading up to one I heard girlfriend girlfriend was mid compared to 100 girlfriends. Is that true? Leave it in the comments below. Your final winner. I've never what seen if we either. just indulge in the harem? Because, boys, why set off one girl when you can have multiple? <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> I already know that. Last, uh, they're married now, right? That's his wife now, right? Man, bro, did y'all see the, the vibe when uh, homegirl got drunk and she was saying some crazy shit about her brother? But what if we could have more? That video was two, crazy, bro. Three or even four that girlfriends was wasn't enough. <laughs> well, right now we have a show so insane, so unhinged, we are now limit testing polygamy. A series about one man who found the infinite Riz glitch, became the apex of all boyfriends, and in the process may have pushed this genre to new heights. So if you looked at a series like Girlfriend, Girlfriend, and thought to yourself, <laughs> I present to you the hundred girlfriends who really, 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 really love you. But if 100 girls still isn't enough for you to choose That's from, then don't worry, because this is we have sponsor? to sponsor, Arc Recode. Now, Let's fair warning that this is going to be for distinguished gentlemen and ladies above the age of- I'm interested! Look at this! Woo! Let's hear it. Hey, roll the ad. Roll the ad. Strategic ad. mobile adult RPG. Listed by oh, wait, wait, this is an adult RPG. Wait, this game contains explicit sexual content. 18 only as it's a new apocalyptic wait i thought they didn't have adult games on the app store strategic mobile adult rpg listed by this labs arc recode allows you to lead us do y'all see what i see bro bro what of sexy charming bruh. This is crazy, bro. Bro, why even wear clothes at this point? I'm not gonna quest. count. Why even wear clothes? This is some MVP freaky the shit. Corner of the universe sends an apostle to Earth to wipe out humanity. Ah. Survivors discover a new energy source called. Astro Don't nobody care about none of that, man. Where did the titties come in? Children, which allows them to create a new scientific civilization ah, in the safe haven nah, 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 nah. as a woman lurking on Earth to prevent the disaster happening. Nah, nah, multiple nah, 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 options nah, nah, nah. in more than one way. You can pick your own strategic. Wait, 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 wait. There's an actual gameplay. To humanity. This is a game that gives. Multiple options in more than one. It's like the I, I bro. It even has a, a speed up timer. Yeah, this game. Is, you can pick your own strategic. You ain't buying this game for game hundreds of different Yo, Iron Mouse. And, what the fuck? Take your pick of Where hundreds Iron of Mouse unique girls with own unique personalities. Save the world and make the perfect harem just in time for the holidays. Ho ho ho! Arc Recode is available on both iOS and Android devices, but make sure you download the game directly from Error Lab site. You can try Why? out Arc Recode today by clicking that link in the description and entering. <laughs> bro, did it for, directly from their site. Why? <laughs> With an illness, oh, okay. girlfriend. Mentoro has an incurable disease. Since birth, he's been infected with an illness known as negative riz. I'm sure many of us know of at least one poor soul who's been infected with such an illness. Right. Graduating from school, he decides to try his luck one last time by confessing to the girl he likes and asking her out. And, okay. uh... Damn, she the, says no. the worst she can say is no. For him, as he's now been rejected a hundred times ever since his first confession when he was just eight months old. That's right. My boy's been trying to chat up girls before he achieved object's permanence. His friends give him a parting gift. A knighthood. Dubbing him Sir Bitchless. <laughs> Baron of the Forever Singleton. <laughs> Yeah, no, like not sir, bitchless. That's a lie, bro. The only thing that can possibly flip his life around and score him a girlfriend. Divine intervention. And somehow, it worked. At a shrine he's praying at, he meets God, who informs Rentaro that he made a little oopsie. He's accidentally given him 100 different soulmates who he's going to be meeting soon. Jackpot, I hear you say. Think of all the girls. Think of all the choices. Oh, by the way, any girl that Rentaro doesn't choose will die. 
What? Bummer. Who should he pick? Who should he pick? What the what the what? Choices. Oh, by the way, any girl that Rentro doesn't choose will die. Bummer. Who should he pick? Who should he reject, knowing the consequences? With a matter of life or death, the prospect of having blood on his hands, he stands up, faces the music, and, and said, makes I'll a decision be where only all a of true them? protagonist can make. If the girls I don't choose dies, there is only one choice to be made. I will date all of them. <laughs> The show is fucking stupid. The harem genre okay. has never exactly been the benchmark of highbrow entertainment. So for those who don't normally indulge in it, you may not understand what the appeal is. Is it for the romance? Well, I wanted to know something. <laughs> and you're serious. I actually was interested in it, like, based on the premise of having 100 girlfriends. How do you make that actually work out? Like, I'm sure because it's an anime, they, they sometimes maybe talk about it. And, I, and other times it's just titty and panty shots, right? But in 100 Girlfriends, if I invest my time into this anime, will it actually give legitimate life advice on what happens when you're trying to pursue multiple partners at the same time? Does it actually give some type of information or maybe does it even criticize the lifestyle of polygamy or anything like that? Or is it just a dumb fucking show? Let me know. So you don't normally indulge in it. You may not understand what the appeal is. Is it for the romance? <laughs> you serious? <laughs> Harem anime are sports anime in disguise. Let me say that again. Bro, Harem. sports animes are fire. Have y'all seen Blue Lock? Anime are sports anime in disguise. Okay. Damn. Find me another striker where you see weebs forming different teams based on picking a side they really want to win and completely investing themselves into cheering for that side's victory, staying dedicated throughout the entire run of the series while shitting on any supporters on the opposing sides. This Damn. is more of a sport than actually sports yeah. anime. You have the Ooh, baby. So these are the fuckers that Ooh. pick one of the first girls that are introduced that are almost always guaranteed to be the winner. They know the rules. First girl wins is the bookie's favorite, and they're happy to play the odds. Then you have the fans of the local teams. These guys think they're above supporting the big brand's mainline girls, so they'll cheer for their second tier side character girls that were introduced in the mid game. They want to feel better by picking the girl that no one else is picking. Oh, this this is dead ass a sport. Ah, they sports betting on who get on oh, on which girl wins. Okay, 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 okay. Just okay, maybe okay, okay, this okay. time the girl actually has a chance of winning. Like yeah. any sport, you follow your team through to the end, no matter how many years it takes, no matter how many hundreds of chapters, until eventually a single girl gets picked. If it's your girl, you celebrate in euphoria. You have the best taste. And if it ain't your girl, you argue online and you say, "I'm gonna kill the author." How could he? Oh my god! Your it's the worst anime, anime she on earth. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fan, Where's manga ever made? Yeah, 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 is yeah, as yeah, sweet as know, laughing at anyone now on Suicide Watch for backing the losing horse. But if your girl lost, there's only one thing you can do: come together threaten with the your fellow degenerates. Nah, threaten the Arthur. It. Together, threaten the author. tell yourself. Threaten the author. Right. She deserved better than that bland protagonist anyway, right? Nah, threaten the author. And that moment will become a scar. Nah, you can't nah bro, I've been on the internet long enough, bro. I was there when they were like hashtag kill Kishimoto. I'm like, what Kishimoto do? Three that will be forever etched in the hearts of fans like any sporting event. Falcons blew a 28-3 lead. How PSG the blew. How the fans like any sporting event. Falcons blew. It's the third quarter and you blew 28 to 3. The Falcons fucked y'all up that game. Blew a 28 3 lead. That's PSG crazy. Blew a 6 1 lead. Rui blew. How do you blow a 6 1 lead in football? Do not swore, then gave him to a vegetable. This is the foundation. Wait, what? Of a, blew a 6 1 lead. Rui blew Natsuo, then gave him to a vegetable. This is the foundation of a harem series. So how can a series in the genre work where every girl is the winner? Every girl gets picked. There is no losing team because everyone immediately wins. Well, you make fun of all that shit. Let's be real. When you're watching a series about some plain, boring ass guy with average looks suddenly having a bunch of hot girls all fawning and fighting over him, you aren't exactly coming into this for some realism you can relate to in your own life, right? Oh God, it's that like With harem anime, your suspension of disbelief has been pushed beyond the stratosphere already, so to parody it, 100 Girlfriend goes, let's just completely obliterate that. Everything, everything has been exaggerated to the point of insanity. Plot, design, characters, we don't have fu- <laughs> I never, in all my life of anime watching, I have never, ever, everything, ever everything seen a design. Everything exaggerated to the point of insanity. Like, plot, design. This.
Never. Ever. This is the first, very first time I've seen an anime design of a woman like this, bro. This is the first one ever, bro. Characters. We don't have five girls or ten girls. We, we have a hundred, bro. How do, you even, just... how do you even have a hundred characters? How, how do you have a hundred characters in the show and they get the same screen time? So Let me guess. She's a turbo Cindere. She's a guy isn't just shy. She's turbo shy. Hikari isn't just horny. She... <laughs> Mains Lisa on Genshin Impact. The series takes all the most ridiculous tropes and cliches we see in the genre, dials a knob up to 100, fucks around, and finds out. <laughs> you know, it actually works. There's a scene early on where the characters have gotten into a bit of a conundrum. Rentaro has successfully convinced the first two girlfriends to date him simultaneously. Okay. Mission accomplished. But That's good. There's a problem. This is a romance anime. And what's the most important endgame achievement for any romance Marriage? anime? That's right. Sharing the first kiss. Oh. But how can you share a first kiss when you have two girls you love equally? to receive a triple that kiss. kiss. Sounds like we got ourselves a little bit triple of a pick kiss. Here, lads. So the girls have a full 1v1 Fox only Final Destination girlfriend off. Trying to out girlfriend each other so only the superior girlfriend will be the lucky There's recipient fighting. of that first kiss. But no, there is no unfairness. No infighting allowed in the Rentaro family so the Giga Chad himself has the perfect solution. Coin toss, rock paper scissors, Nah. He devises a system where they split up and stand up at randomized points based on a dice roll. They are all blindfolded, having music blaring in their ears at full blast. He rolls a dice, waits a random number of seconds based on that dice roll so neither girl knows if he's waited a long or short time, then rolls again. He goes left if it's odd, right if it's even, kisses the girl, then moves on to kiss the other girl. Once he's finished, he returns to the starting position and bobs your uncle. The first kiss with each girl has been accomplished and neither party knows who the first kiss was with. This is the first kiss equalizer. I mean, I guess it works. <laughs> this is one of the saneest things you ever see in the show. Does this mean it's a show that's above showing fan service because it's meant to be parody? Nah, bro, bro, we just saw a girl hit a show you can want her titty. Nah, bro. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Nah, that's crazy. Who drew this? And it was a woman, too, bro. It's, it's always the women anime or uh, women mangaka that draw some crazy shit like this. It's like literally everybody's like, like oh, men, uh, uh, video games appeal to the male sexual fantasy, anime appeals to the male sexual fantasy, and then you'd be like, all right, who drew this shit? A woman. <laughs> No, you know how to openly the genre without being overly reliant on cheap shots. Because the biggest compliment I can give it is that beyond being just a parody, Damn, the cast have genuine him with the chemistry with each other. Always Sunny, Parks and Recreation, Peep Show. A Never seen any of those. Have a core cast Bro, of the only sitcom that I enjoy is My Name Is Earl in the Office. Pretty works so well with each other. So the secret is just putting them in different the situations office. to see how they act. Oh, Always Sunny in Philadelphia is pretty good too. Girlfriends yeah, like a putting an all you can eat buffet of every insane character trope you see in anime in the most unhinged situation situations you can think of and seeing what kind of insanity would ensue. The girls play off each other as much as they do rent a row. They fight with each other, banter with each other, sincerely care for one another. Every girl has a different dynamic with every other girl and partway through the series the harem starts acting more like some dysfunctional family than anything else. When I started this series I thought it was going to be some low XD silly meme show with a funny gimmick that I would get bored of after a few episodes. But after I caught up to the anime and realized that wasn't enough I started blasting through the manga and it was around girlfriend 12 that it slowly started to dawn on me that holy shit. This isn't just a gimmick. These mad lads are actually committing to the idea. You'd think with such okay, a bad that's what I'm wondering. Concept, it'd be easy to that's just what I'm wondering. It, introduce a bunch of girls and relegate most of them to background NPCs to let us select No, like shine. give actual and development. You, How? Reading, you see the author going the extra mile for every single one of them. Every girl gets a time to shine. Not Good. a single one of them is some half-baked stereotype. Even Good. if they start off with some trope you've seen before, the series takes its time to get you to care about each and every Wait, one Wait, hold on. How old is this woman? Or is she just tall? Start off with some oh, is she the American, the, series the American takes girl? to care about each and every one of them as a person. This is one of those shows that tells you not to take it too seriously. The but then takes it seriously. Down on these serious moments you might expect you to make it hit even harder. And for any other harem manga, this would simply collapse under the weight of its own ambition, but 100 Girlfriends has the glue. Bro, these are all harem mangas in, it, it, bro, 7.72, 7.9. 8.5. This is the highest one I've seen so far. For any other Harry. 8.47. Okay. This is the K Kaima Katsuiga is a high school student. Okay. Manga. The God of Conquest. What the fuck? But this was 7.6, 7.9, 7, 7, 7, 7. It's just like sevens all around, bro. The, the Harry manga must honestly be pretty.
8.12. Okay, there ain't no but nines. 100 girlfriends has Bro, 100 Girlfriends supposed to be one of the best harem animes, and it's a 7 point. Of its own ambition, but 100. 7.84, 51,000 people reviewed it. 100,000 people reviewed this one. And this one got an 8, so this one got to be better. Harem manga. 97,094. Man, you guys are really yeah, out here reading this shit. 82,000 people. That's under the weight of its own. Yeah, bro. 57,000 people. 100 girlfriends. Bro, 51K, 7.1 or 7.8. I don't get it. The glue that I don't get it. Why are we talking about this anime and not the other thing together? Michael Jordan, Lionel oh. Messi, Muhammad oh. Ali. Tiger I know that guy. What do oh. they have in common with Ijo Rentero? They're all black. That's right. They're the goats of their respective positions. Oh. I mean, with multiple women. My man saw Japan's hey, population you crisis know, and said, Tiger, bro, Tiger Woods is a crazy motherfucker. I'll do it myself. Here is someone in line to father more children than Genghis Khan. And you know, Genghis Khan himself once said, and I quote, The greatest joy for a man is to defeat his enemies, to drive them before him, to take all they possess, to see those they love in tears, to ride their horses and hold their wives and daughters in his arms. So clearly, Genghis played League of Legends. But Rentaro isn't a toxic gamer like that. He captures the the hearts of women Genghis by being Khan the best savage, damn boyfriend bro. is actually possible to be. If there was a complete antithesis to Kazuya, Rentaro would be it. He doesn't just show love to his girlfriends. He Nishima. downright worships his girlfriends. Every single one of them. Mm. Equally. And you mm. know what? He fucking deserves it. Here is a man who has only known rejection in his life. The Giga Chad confessed the hundred times. Uh, yeah. Failed 100. That's, you know what? That's actually really good. I will say that for a plot, that is actually really good to have a guy that's always been rejected and now he's getting every girl and he's actually treating them all with respect. Like, that's real. Like, that's Here's some real shit. Only known Cause like some guys, after they start getting girls, they just start treating girls like objects. And this guy got a hundred girls. He treated them all respectfully. That's, that's Action crazy. In his life. That's the Giga Chad confessed a hundred times, failed 100 times and didn't let that phase him. Where every other harem protagonist takes two a hundred times, failed 100 times, and didn't let that phase him. Where every other- They literally all look the fucking same, bro. They all look the same. This is disappointing. The harem protagonist takes this 200 chapters to come to terms with their feelings. Rentaro only knows the pain of unrequainted love and will go to any lengths to make sure his loved ones don't feel that same thing. One of his potential girlfriends suffered from crippling shyness. She was a background character and just by getting a bit of attention, she would disappear. All she could muster up was the strength to confess behind a wall and that was okay. That was all she needed to be satisfied before she would fade away again. And she did. She would never be seen again, it was said as the chapter comes to an end. Only for Rentaro to rip the manga pages to shred, force the chapter to keep going, goes literally <laughs> superhuman looking for her and didn't stop until he could say, I love you, bitch. bitch. <laughs> I'm never gonna stop loving you, bitch. <laughs> literally bend the laws of reality to make every single one of his girlfriends happy. He is the apex boyfriend every boyfriend aspires to be, and under his watch, there is no best girl war. Every girl is equally loved. All girls are best girl. There is no contest. If the readers want to vote on their favorite, he will literally rig the vote so every single one of the girls get the same amount. In the harem series containing the harem of harems, theoretically the most ferocious battlefield you'd be able to find in anime, he's achieved the waifu world peace. Now, if that's not real power, I don't know what is. 100 Girlfriends is truly an enigma, a series with an insane premise that actually fully commits to it and delivers where most of the series in a genre is parodying fails. Currently, we're about 150 chapters in and about 26 girlfriends have been introduced at the time of recording. What? <laughs> Bro, I ain't gonna lie. I thought the series was already done. I, I thought they already had 100 girls. Bro, we only at number 26, bro. Y'all talking all this big talk for 26 girls, bro. We ain't even at 50. Ain't no way the author is going to be able to have 100. I thought he did it somehow. I'm like, I don't know how he got 100 girls in here. But uh, hey, he making it work. I, it does only 26. Just in and about 26 girls. That, that's a lot of people too. I ain't gonna lie. 26 characters, 27, I guess, if you count the main dude. That's a lot of characters in the show. At the time of recording. That is a lot yes, of characters. Only just over a quarter of the way through. Yeah, and bro. Like, they are fully dedicated to getting that full 100. So no matter how many more hundreds of chapters or years I have to wait. Yeah, it's gonna take some time, brother. This, whatever the end game of this harem looks like. I ain't got my glasses. How much are these? 9.99. You think I can get some bitches with these? <laughs> Hell 
<laughs> Go get them, Gramps. Go get them. Like, what do you get a hundred just for? Bro, I think Luffy's gonna fight. Uh, well, I don't know. Look, man, I'm not big into One Piece, but bro, I could have sworn Luffy was about to find that shit, right? After he goes to gear five, he's gonna find it, right? I don't know. Y'all let me know. I don't know. I have no clue, bro. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed that video. Thank you very much this month to Author Curtis Eckstein, Basil, Dysfunctional Degenerate, Flabberwalk, Dysfunctional Degenerate, Misaka 12315, Payne Patchett, Pony Stark, Shouting Zombie, Walter Geist VT, and everyone else on my Patreon for helping to support me for this yeah, month. everybody else. This video Shout out to Giga, After man. this video, I realize I think I may have an addiction to manga with the word girlfriend in it. And I have no idea why. Domestic girlfriend, rent a girlfriend, a hundred girlfriends. I'm sure there's another girlfriend I'm missing. Um, yeah, I have a problem. Oh God, they've discovered the secret to make me read the manga. Anyway though guys, hope you are ready for this Christmas holiday. This is going to be the last video this year before my best of anime of 2023 coming out in January next year. I'm going to be enjoying my Christmas holiday as well. So hope you do as well. Anyway though, that's been it from me. I've been Giguk. Yeah, that was fire, fire video. So yeah, 100 girlfriends. Yeah, I'm still interested on how they actually dive into the roles of the, the polygamy scene. So let me know in the comments below. Bye-bye.